In the early 1900s, wastewater treatment was revolutionized by a new idea, aeration, and the activated sludge process spread rapidly around the world. Oxygen is so important to sludge treatment that a plant's capacity is defined in pounds per day of biological oxygen demand, or BOD. The standard method for measuring BOD is US EPA method 5210B. Since the test measures microbial oxygen consumption, it requires five days to complete. BOD is also important to industry. Compared to the predictable carbon compounds of residential sewage, industrial waste is a wild card. So regulators issue permits that define discharge limits, and one of these limits is BOD. So how can a permit holder monitor for compliance when a BOD-5 test requires five days to complete? Fortunately, there are other ways to measure oxygen demand, such as COD, TOD, CBOD, and correlation to TOC. Methods differ, but the goal is the same, to oxidize a sample and determine how much oxygen will be needed for treatment. Measuring COD with standard method 410.4 sometimes called the potassium dichromate method, relies on reagents to accelerate the oxidation of a sample. In this procedure, the glassware is sterilized at 500 degrees C for one hour. Sample is then combined with reagents and a digestion solution and heated for two hours. The oxidized sample is then measured colorimetrically. While method 410.4 and related cuvette tests is much faster than testing for BOD5, it still takes up to three hours to complete. Dilution is required above 900 mg per liter, and parallel duplicate tests are recommended due to poor repeatability. Accuracy is only plus or minus 20% due to interferences from chlorides and nitrogen compounds, not to mention dilution errors. And since the test depends on the use of dangerous toxic chemicals, the lab must be audited and must maintain a documented disposal program. Fortunately, there's a faster, chemical-free option. TOD total oxygen demand doesn't depend on microbes or chemicals. Instead, the sample is oxidized quickly, cleanly, and completely, using only high temperature, and the resulting oxygen depletion is easily measured with an O2 gas detector without toxic reagents or chemicals of any kind. The TOD measurement method has now been automated for laboratory use with the Quick COD Lab. Using combustion at 1200 degrees C, the Quick COD Lab operates under the same principles used for many years in hundreds of installations by the online Quick COD Ultra. Now, the same combustion technology is sized and scaled for benchtop use by laboratory personnel. Let's take a look at how it works. During operation, a nitrogen carrier gas circulates continuously through the analyzer, and a small amount of air is added to provide a baseline of oxygen for the measurement. The nitrogen gas makes a circuit through the analyzer, where it passes through a high temperature furnace. The gas is then cooled and sent through a quartz filter, an acid trap, and an air filter. Before exiting the analyzer, the gas passes through a zirconium O2 detector, which continuously measures the O2 level in the gas stream. A precision syringe is used to introduce a precise amount of sample into the furnace, where it instantly combusts, depleting the oxygen until no oxidizable compounds remain. As the gas passes through the O2 detector, the measurement is transferred to a Windows PC where software inverts the negative oxygen depletion curve to display a positive oxygen demand curve. The total area within the curve is calculated to provide a complete TOD measurement. With the sample now consumed, the oxygen level returns to the baseline and the system is ready to perform another measurement. In manual operation, the operator starts a measurement cycle and the software alerts the operator when it's time to inject the sample. After 40 to 60 seconds, the resulting curve begins to appear on the screen. The analyzer continues the measurement for 180 seconds or until the operator stops the cycle. The final result is displayed and can be exported as a CSV file for archiving and analysis. The measurement is completed in only three minutes without reagents. With a three-minute measurement cycle, up to 100 manual measurements are possible in a single eight-hour day, and repeatability of 3% or better is typical. The Quick COD Lab has an optional auto sampler. The sampler holds 60 sample vessels, each with its own magnetic stirrer. The auto sampler enables the analyzer to run up to 60 samples unattended, freeing staff to perform other tasks. 
It can also be programmed to measure each vessel in replicate, enabling improved accuracy through the elimination of outliers. Remarkably, the auto sampler enables hundreds of TOD measurements to be completed in a single day. The Quick COD Lab is only one of many advanced water monitoring technologies available through Liquid Analytical Resource. For more information on this or any of our products and services, visit www.larllc.com, call 262-429-1310, or send email to marketing at larllc.com.